So those who've been following my vlogs around about two weeks ago, if you remember, I came to the Yorkshire Dales and Malham Cove and it was quite a wet affair. Now, I promised a few of my um, viewers, stroke subscribers, that I would return to this location. And yes, I have returned to this location. I'm currently at Malin Cove and the conditions are much better. Thank goodness. I arrived at sunrise and I got a fleeting flash of light which lasted about 10-15 minutes so yeah I went through went through all that pain for 10 or 15 minutes of light and I did manage to capture the cluster of trees if you remember I shot uh, an image last time I was here using the limestone as foreground interest using a telephoto uh, but focusing on the cluster of trees so yeah as a as I said previously, I've promised to return and capture that cluster of trees and that's exactly what I've done. Sorry photo shot. I got quite lucky. The way the sun... <gasps> got some light now illuminating the scene. This is very nice. That's just going to leave you for the time being. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I was saying before I was rudely interrupted by the sun lighting the scene that I wanted to return to this location to capture that fine looking cluster of trees and that's exactly what I've done. I had to work out. I tell you what, it wasn't until I got here when I realised that it, it's quite difficult to get some separation I was very conscious of that I think I think the last shot I've taken illuminate the foreground and the background is dark has helped in separation of course I'm talking to you live I need to get on to some post-processing but I think the plan of setting my alarm at three o'clock in the morning has worked. This is one of those locations where it's quite overwhelming with the ph photographic opportunities available. The, the problem is, as with a lot of landscape photography, is try to make it appealing and easy on the eye, void of any distractions, and this is definitely going to be a place I'm going to return to uh, again and again. So I've moved on to the limestone pavement uh, just above the cove itself. It's quite a drop, you know, about 80 metre drop. Wonderful creation. Um, millions of years carved out by the last ice age. I could go on, but I won't. Anyway, limestone and trying to get a composition is hard and very difficult. There is natural leading lines, of course, but then I'm struggling to find something to 
lead the, the eye to a, a background. There's something here behind me, for instance. Nice diagonals using the limestone leading up to some trees, but I can't get a position where I leave out the sky. Um, if I'm going to include the sky, it's just going to distract the the viewer's eye because it's quite a, a bright area of the scene. So I'm just trying to work around it, but it's important in landscape photography just to move on, make that decision. If it's not going to work, then move on. That's exactly what I'm going to do now. An absolutely beautiful morning. The light is just dashing, racing across the hillside, illuminating the different angles and shapes, sound of the birds. I'm half asleep, but I tell you what, I'm glad I'm here. Conditions are changing and they're changing for the best because we've got some lovely moodage going on now. It's like there's a storm and it's where limestone, stormy clouds, beautiful, love it, a bit of black and white. So I've set up here using the limestone features, leading the eye in. You've got the cove bending round, it's all about the diagonals again, and that beautiful sky going on. I was going to get hit by another rainstorm but it moved on. It obviously thought let's give this guy a chance, he's had enough rain recently. So the sun has reappeared. The light is a bit harsh, it's what about three hours after sunrise but what a great little morning session. I'm going to do more of these uh, little morning sessions every now and then. It's only about an hour away from where I live, it makes a change from heading to the Lake District. The wind is getting up though. Uh, I need to venture more uh, around the Yorkshire Dales. It's when it all first started for me, landscape photographer. Really pleased with the session though and how it went. So without further ado, I'm going to head back, head back to my car, get some brekkie and enjoy the rest of the day. And you know what? The rain has come. Ha! Ha! You're too late. Anyway, keep smiling. Till next time, bye bye for now. Mm -hmm.